one's gone that way. We're just gonna say, hey, where are the other one? Geez, he's chunky, eh? nice and black. He's gonna cross the road. Still across the road. Nice moose. Beauty. He's he's uh 48 or inches wide or so. Mr. Merton was here. That wolf was all around her the day before, but then Martin was here and Set my 330 off, took the bait. I found it over there. Some of it. I uh, gonna wire this back in. Yeah, trap was still in the boxes, pulled it out there to reset it. I'm just heading that way to break more trail and Try to get some more sets out. Good thing I come back over here. That trap in there till I come back, set off. I like to be able to just stay out here, but fellow got to work, eh? So uh, I put a a cone there with some stinky beaver in there too. See how he likes that. See if he sets that trap off, he might come back and get caught in the cone set. I got one up there a couple hundred yards away. That's where his track was the other day. And then I met it coming through just before this box. I said, ah, fuck. It's probably here. Okay, we're gonna go try to get further. Not much daylight. I went around the slough, kind of went down to the end. Holy crap. She's hummocky. All the water's gone out of the slough, so it's even like the beaver shoots that they go up into the woods. Usually they're full and you just go over them. You don't even know they're there, but I had to creep down in them. So, not nice. And I just buried myself in snow. I ain't got my fur add on. It's too warm. It's only minus 10 Celsius. And I had to, didn't have my hood up because I was there doing stuff. So I take my hood down so I don't sweat. And I hit that tree and there's only a, a bit of snow on the trees, but felt like two feet. Okay, we're gonna head over there see if we can get full of snow again.
Maybe I'll put a set out in there. I think I will. I went over. I went over there another few kilometers, but I hit another burn from the summer. Shit fell down everywhere. <coughs> so I gotta try to get a few boxes out around it. It's not much sign, but I never set on sign for Wolverine. They usually find me. But the links did go in there. I used to have a box in there years ago. So we'll put another one out. What the hell? Nothing ventured, nothing gained. Boy, it's hard staying upright. Pretty easy to tip over. She's hummocky. And like I said, no water, so it's holes everywhere. Okay, I better get this one done. It's getting late. stuff before I leave to go home again tomorrow so I figure I'd come up and uh, see if I can catch that Martin eater. <sighs> yeah, he's in there. <laughs> Looks like a male. It's a male. I gotta fool around with it in a bit here because He's got the bait in his mouth, and I got it wired in. Nice dark fellow. I got a fisher here last year. That was about it. Been on the edge of the cut block here, so figure I might toy in a Wolverine or something. Beaver meat for bait. I got some links there, but I got beaver meat in this one.
Ooh. That's stinky. Yeah. See if it produces. Doing them quick because I got my truck plugged into the generator, so to start. And uh, I'll go back and start her up and load up and go put some bait out. Yeah, I'm gonna go set another box down the other end. I see a lynx was crossing down there. Yeah, nice day. Nice day, Shade. I'm gonna put lynx meat in this one because the cat's been coming and going here. I'm gonna put it right there. I had a set here in the past and I've had a, a snare or two up there. Looks like he walked up that log. Okay, we'll get her all set up here. Ah, nice beauty day. How's it going guys and gals? Just out in the shop here. It's uh, the next night after I got home from the trap line. Furs are hanging, just got the traps off them. That's the Wolverine I got, female. No, uh, well, he is the same way, it's a pretty dark one. Just got a bit of a throat patch. If I weighed that fisher, with the teeth on that thing. He was uh, almost 12 pound. And Martin. And the lynx. And look that and see what it is. Female. Nice big female. No, it's male. I haven't weighed him yet either. I'll weigh him before I skin him. But he's probably 26, 27 pound. He's bigger than that female that was over. And that one was 25 pound. 330. On beaver meat and deer scraps. Same with that. And that one. And now I got lynx meat in some of them. And this fisher, he came and eat a martin. And then the next I set the trap up. I don't know how long the martin was eat because it was like a week or so, eight days or something before I checked because I was working. So I fixed that trap up. And the next day I had him. He looks skinny there, but he's pretty chunky. So, and then I come home and I had a rabbit. I had three snares out and I got three rabbits, you know. So, I'm gonna skin this one up and another one uh, I got in the fridge already and take out two to Larry. He's the elder of the trap line. So, he likes rabbits. Yeah. Got a Martin right there on the board pointing towards me. That links, they need to come off the board too. So, better get out of here. Just home from work. It's uh, time I make supper and all the other stuff. Time I get out here, it's almost time to go to bed. So, I'm going to skin that rabbit and that fisher and that Martin. That'll be it for tonight because the rest are frozen. So we'll see you, see you soon. <laughs>